at 900 metres to the winning post the first time and then one complete circuit of the track and they've got a hard two miles ahead of them as the gates open and they're off and running and our Palliser was allowed to dawdle out of the starting gates and Devious Lady is the first out from our rationale followed by the three-year-old Might. Round the World is going to settle down in the box seat followed by Copper Tonic and then Maya Card, Semstar, Equity Girl, Sir Zamazan. Sir Clare on is next on the outside of our Palliser followed by Banderol and dropping out to be two lengths last is Sea Swift. Coming around the home turn the first time and the leader is Devious Lady. Showed the way from our Rationale who's racing very wide on the corner. Might is out in the middle of the track and even in the early stages of the race they're out there looking for this firmer ground. Further back is Round the World and then Semstar, Copper Tonic and Maya Card followed by Sir Zamazan, Equity Girl. Then Sir Clare on and our Palliser and Sea Swift is back at the tail of the field as they head down towards the winning post on the first occasion about 2300 metres out and Devious this lady has raced away in front to lead by seven or eight lengths on our rationale. A length and a quarter to might, one and a half round the world, one and a half sem star and a half length away copper tonic. About three to Maya card, a length and a half to equity girl on the outside of Sir Zamazan and Sir Clairon. And then Banderol and our Palliser and back at the tail of the field is Sea Swift as they churn into the going. On the turn out of the straight, 2,000 metres out, Devious Lady the leader. She's about six in front of our rationale, two lengths away, might two to round the world, three to Sem Star, a length and a half to Copper Tonic, a gap to Maya Card, and then Equity Girl, Banderol on the outside of Sir Clairon, followed by Sir Zamazan and our Palliser, and two lengths away last is Sea Swift. The Sydney Cup field goes over the crossing at the 1600 mark, and to the back of the course they go now, and it's Devious Lady a mile in front. Devious Lady led by eight lengths on our rationale, a length and a half to Might, a length and a half round the world, getting a perfect run, and then Sem Star, Copper Tonic, Maya card followed by equity girl banderol ridden patiently well back in the field sir clare on on the inside of our palliser and the last two are sea swift and sir zamazan as they go down the back straight now towards the top turn and they've got about 1200 meters to go and devious lady goes further ahead Devious Lady opens up a lead of 12 lengths now on our Rationale. Might is in third place, followed by Round the World, and then Semstar, Copper Tonic, Maya Card. Banderol is still well back with Equity Girl, followed by Sir Clare on, and then Sea Swift and our Palliser, and Sir Zamazan is last as they swing around the top turn. They've got 900 metres to go, and Devious Lady is well out in front. She led by eight or nine lengths on our Rationale, with Might in third place, followed by Semstar, and then Round the World, and further back, Maya a card, Copper Tonic, Banderol starting to work his way into it now, followed by Equity Girl, our Palace is a mile back and hard ridden, so is Sea Swift and then Sir Clairon and Sir Zamazan and Devious Lady is coming back to them now, in fact she's showing signs of distress, she's gone Devious Lady and round the world and our rationale have raced to the lead on the turn round the world and our rationale straighten up in front, Banderol looming into third place now, and then Copper Tonic followed by Might and Semstar but Banderol has raced to the lead Banderol shot to the lead on top of the rise. Round the world not done with yet, though. On the outside, round the world won't give up. She again is coming at Banderol, and she's going to make a race of it. Round the world and Banderol are fighting out a terrific struggle. Round the world, after being headed again, gets to the lead. Now it's Banderol kicking again. What a finish in the cup. Banderol round the world. Banderol. Banderol has come again and won it by a nose to round the world in a tremendous finish. Equity Girl will be third in front of Copper Tonic, followed by Sem Star. Then our Rationale might. Our Palliser, Sea Swift, Maya Card, Devious Lady. Well back as Sir Zamazan and Sir Clairon is last in the Sydney Cup of 1988. What a finish. What a finish between New Zealand's Banderol and the Sydney Mayor round the world, the, the lead seesawed. One would get to the front and then the other in uh, a dramatic finish to the Sydney Cup of 1988. Banderol, Peter Cook uh, on the TAB showing $1.70 and 80. Round the world on the place tote showing 75 cents. And was it Equity Girl I call third? I think it was, number 10, $1.20. Ken, rotten conditions, but I don't think I've ever seen a more thrilling finish in a major race. It was a great race, John. I thought Banderol had won for sure at the uh, 300 metres. I thought uh, Round the World had him done again with about 10 metres to go, but right on the line, there's no doubt that Banderol's got the prize. And you'll find that uh, Banderol, ridden by Peter Cook, 
second in the Wellington Cup to pay a dollar seventy as John told you on the tote has come across the Tasman to win another great two mile race or 3200 metre race the Sydney Cup and it's now official three six and ten bound to roll round the world second for the second time over 3200 metres an equity girl in third place that's the story of the Sydney Cup of 1988 the two favourites fighting it out if you're on the other one good luck unfortunately I just got beaten but there's three races to go and in race six the hallmark stakes here at Randwick I'm going for number five Investor. Okay, Ken, 3, 6, 10 are the official numbers on the Sydney Cup of 1988. I've, uh, honestly, I'm, I'm still uh, recomposing myself. Uh, that was an, an enormous uh, finish. Uh, Banderol is about to be brought back to scale. That's Peter Cook's second win in the Sydney Cup. And uh, one of his best rides, Banderol Peter Cook, about to return.